I don't want to play this game anymore. I really don't. I knew it'd be hard. Damn. When was it ever easy? How many times during my countless raids did death stare me right in the face? But that hideous face staring back at me was beyond even my imagination. There is no escape. Your body belongs to me. Men, attack! This game shows you immediately the best that it can ever be. I swear to God. This sequence is like later on in the game. It's showing you like the epic battle. This is as good as the game will ever get right at the beginning. And it's hilarious because then they drop you into really terrible, boring, frustrating, crappy combat and gameplay. Thinking that, you know, that's cool. It's not. That's almost the same criticism I had in Blizzard. Two. It's the same fucking game. Look at this asshole over here. He's not even attacking me. All of the enemy attacks are quicker than yours. Your three button combo is fucking worthless. God, you're in the middle of your fucking swinging animation, and he's able to just take you out. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Just Indiana Jones' ass. That's fuck, man. Fucking combat. There's nothing fucking on this island. Let's just go clear it out so that we fucking get glory. Shut your face! Oh shit, your brother showed up. What the fuck? Oh fuck, oh fuck, fuck you. Oh fuck you, oh! Oh, what the fuck? You get to fucking. J fuck you! What the f Oh fuck you. Oh, oh, and you just turn around in half a second to fucking. Into and you jump forward like a fucking. What the fuck? You're fucking bullshit! This game is fucking bullshit! Oh my god! Do you see how the- This is the starting enemies! These are your fucking starting enemies. You see how his name is Red? His name is fucking Red. If I didn't have this guy helping me, this would be so frustrating! DON'T START YOUR GAMES LIKE THIS! THIS HAPPENED IN RISEN 2! YOU DIDN'T LEARN YOUR FUCKING LESSON! Nobody will want to play your shitty fucking game we for another 50 stop. hours! Did you see how my 
my dude like literally fucking teleported over there. He fucking teleported over there. And that's what those goddamn birds were doing to me earlier. Teleporting. Fucking stiff, rigid animation system. Stop fucking charging up! I just want you to do your normal attack, not your goddamn spin and swing! Just fucking attack him! Stop spinning around like a fucking ballerina! Fucking attack him! You just press A once! If you want to do that, then put a separation between heavy attacks and light attacks! Fuck this combat system! Oh, you're gonna miss! You're gonna miss right the fuck in front of his face! Okay. Oh, okay. Alright, yeah. That makes sense. This is neither fun nor enjoyable. Your combat is pathetically simplistic and extremely rigid with shitty animations that you are fucking trapped in the entire fucking time. When I want a light attack, when I want something quick, like where the bird can uh, uh, fucking nip at you super quick, you have my character swing around for a full fucking second before he fucking attacks. And I have no control over that whatsoever. Your combat sucks. Your sword play sucks. And you've learned nothing from Risen 2 Dark Waters. Don't even try to pass this off as a true sequel. When you make zero improvements to combat, you added nuances. You're a damn liar and you know it. Oh my god. There's no targeting! You can't fucking target! You can't stay locked on a... If you can't stay locked... If there's no... Fucking lock on in this game... Okay, <clears throat> that I did not want to forget. Oh my god. I missed. I was in point blank range. And I missed again, that's cool. Yeah. A point blank range? Oh, I got him that time, that's cool. Attack, and I and I'm stuck in my animation, and I can't. I have to randomly see which animation I get. Without the ability to do light and heavy. Save it right here and go see what that massive gigantic thing over there is and then we'll leave. This is probably not the best. What the f Leviathan? I don't think I'm going to win again. Oh, oh no. Oh no, I'm stuck. I'm stuck, but so is he. Quite disgusting. Let's see if we could shoot it. Uh, yeah, we'll shoot it from here. Missed. Missed. Got him. 
ammunition. No more ammunition. Get to my fucking boat! What the fuck? What the fuck is this shit? I've been able to do this all game long and I can't. Okay, cool. Cool, there's a fucking invisible wall here, even though. That's awesome. Let me go back to the island and I'll use the boat there, but that's just stupid. As much as I, I kind of want to do that island, like I said, I don't want to do it if, if it doesn't come with the main campaign. Because I think this Island of Thieves and the Fog Island are pre-orders. Yeah, it's because I knew it. I fucking knew it. It's $5 for Fog Island. But it's in my game because it's a review copy. And Uprising of the Little Guys DLC. Uprising of the little guys five dollars, so you have to pay an additional ten dollars Uprising of the little guys 499 fog island 499 adventure garb uh, two dollars <throat> And the game is 50 bucks what a clever fucking way to get <laughs> the the rest of the ten dollars just break off two of the islands and charge five bucks a piece for them, so you go from fifty to sixty dollars. Uh, the game gets one star from one customer review and a seventy on Metacritic from critics. Let's see, Chris, combat system is pretty bad. Thank you. Overall, the game quality is like one of a game that has been published in two thousand eight. He ain't lying. Is, I mean, it's a very simplistic review. Just, just, I mean, there's nothing to it, but he told you everything that you needed to know. Ah, uh, Chris. <laughs> Kill him. Kill him. I will roll around. I will roll around. You kill him. I will take care of the rolling. Dust. Thank you. Oh. This is it? Yeah. The harbor town of Antigua. What have I got myself into? Well, it's no use. Thank you for your help. Here, take this. I'll try and sell my wares if you need. Flynn, I'll get you out of there. What the? Oh, you all right? What the hell was that? Thanks. I thought I'd have to rot here forever. How did you manage to free me? No, no idea. idea. My encounter with <laughs> the Shadow Lord at Crab Coast could have something to do with it. I said A no Shadow idea. Lord. What are you? Right. On the top floor of the warehouse, there's a... Some old bloke. I've forgotten his name. I see. It's probably rubbish. Take them. All right. Cool. Magical things on the top of this. On the top floor of the warehouse. Let's get those and then I'll end the stream. But thank you very much, you guys, for coming out. You know what's funny is I remember this exact area in Risen 2. They've reused this area from Risen 2. They've reused all these assets. This is the same area. Yes. Thank you guys for coming out and enduring with me. I know a lot of you think this game is boring. Um, that's because it, it, for the most part it is. I'm going to play this game some more tomorrow, but I think I'll just do a local recording. I might stream it. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but thank you for coming out tonight. Hit the follow button if you're not following already. And um, Alright. Okay, cool. Alright, I'll see you guys on the next Angry Joe Show.
Thanks for coming out tonight.